probably seen the restoration videos of this little bike and it's been running fairly well since I've completed the restoration but the only problem I've had is, is with the timing the old points point system um, point system timing was so unreliable very difficult to set and then it would creep out so I found the optimum timing setting was about 8 degrees in advance of the, the timing mark on the flywheel and then it had quite a the reasonable amount of power for a short time until the timing <laughs> kind of crept out again and I tried setting the, the, the original set of points which were which were these the the, um, the cam wiper had practically worn away which didn't help so I decided to get a new set of points but I couldn't get the original set one the same as the original set so I had to get a smaller set and that made it even more difficult to set the timing and for some reason it still kept kind of creeping out I don't know whether it's the the wiper on the cam was gradually wearing away or something I found the wider the if you widen the gap it advanced the ignition uh, by the way that's that's the that's the way around it worked so what I decided to do in the end was strip the whole that out strip all the um, the point system out so I've got rid of the the ignition source coil which goes in the generator the the, the ignition coil which steps the voltage up to the spark plug uh, and the inside cover to, to that cover I didn't need anymore and this plastic cover I couldn't get back on with the new installation so I replaced all that with just this um, it's the, the electronic magneto and flywheel off of an old grass trimmer or weed eater as the, the Americans call them so that's the that's the uh, that's the, the the flywheel off of the old grass trimmer and I tried to um, reduce the, the weight or the mass as much as possible because the weight of the flywheel um, as it is was about right I didn't want to kind of add any mass to it or as little as I could get away with and that's the electronic um, magneto which is obviously so much so much more reliable than the point system but it was quite a major job, machining job. I had to cut this, um, cut this disc out and turn it on the lathe to, to kind of exactly fit the round the flywheel and get get three. There was only really three solid mountings available: two at two there and there, and then one at the bottom. Because because what you've got to do is mount the electronic magneto very rigidly, because it's got to be as close as possible to the to the flywheel magnet without actually touching it so it's got to be it's got to be a very good mounting so anyway that's that's the the, the new installation on the bike uh, and I've, I made this this original cover can go back on um, I'll, put, I'll put it back on then I'll, I'll fire it up to actually show you it running Actually, I should have mentioned the, the timing setting because it's, it's so much easier to um, set the timing with this system. Because all you've got to do is loosen that uh, centre nut and, and turn the turn the, the, the old grass trimmer flywheel um, in rel in, rel in a relation to the original flywheel, and that that changes the timing. And the way you can see there, that's that's the mark where the manufacturers recommend the firing should take place. And that, and you can see this this mark on the the, uh, the strimmer flywheel is, is is slightly in advance, about eight degrees in advance, and that gives the that gives the optimum timing setting. So anyway, I'll put the cover on now and fire it up. So that's what it looks like with the cover back on, the, the original uh, metal cover. And I, because it's such a difficult shape to kind of cover up make a cover for a weatherproof cover of I've just done it with with duct tape <laughs> that's, that's the easy way of doing it sealed all the, all the gaps up so it should be more or less um, weatherproof but when the engine's running it's hot in there anyway so any uh, any water that does get in will, will dry up pretty quick so I'll just just show it running now because it's pouring with rain now so I won't stay out there too long <laughs> 
Yeah.